hello guys welcome back to my channel so today we are at the land of the sami alta today's video is all about exploring the beautiful city of alta alta is located in the north of norway with obviously the region their meat are very tasteful if you haven't tasted it you need to try it and tell me later it's a beautiful place with beautiful people so let's see, see it and let's explore this beautiful city of the sami the Sami are a group of people in Northern Europe living in large areas of Scandinavia, Northern Finland and Northwestern Russia. From the Kola Peninsula in the northeast to Dalarna and Fomen in the south. It is difficult to state exactly how many Sami they are in that ethnic definition can vary. And besides, it is up to each individual as to whether they want to consider themselves to be Sami but most figure out that there are somewhere between 50,000 and 100 times some in all. The largest group lives in Norway. Earlier on it was usual to divide the Sami people into four main groups according to mood of living and dwelling. Sea Sami, River and Lake Sami, Forest Sami and Mountain Sami. But this had been more and more abandoned. The Sami society today is similarly composed and differentiated as just about any other modern society. Still, Sami cultural policies today is focused on not breaking the connection back to traditional values in the building up to the new. For example, the people are trying to stress taking care of the close connection to the natural surroundings. Lately, with the increased environmental disturbance and ecological catastrophes, the indigenous people form of life has been embraced with increasing interest. The perspective is on the verge of changing from considering this culture as primarily to seeking valuable information from them. So guys, I was told that this tomb was buried during the second world war it's a safety place in case russia was to attack again or to bomb everyone was to go in there for safety so that was the reason why that tomb is there and it was burned so guys we are at the uh, student apartment so you can look at it you can see it's painted with red that is the student apartment in autumn we also have another student, newly constructed student apartment or houses in outer and it, not too long we will get to it so I will encourage you to keep watching and you will see a lot of beautiful places. We also have the, we also, I will also get to show you the beautiful university, the outer university and also the newly constructed uh, special hospital. Our population of Sami in Norway. Sweden, Finland and Russia is estimated approximately and about half of them live in Norway. The vast majority of settlements are located in northern Norway, primarily the country of Finnmark. There are however Sami communities as far as the south. Many think that Sami traditions only consist of colorful costumes, traditional handicraft products and catching reindeer with lasso. But the Sami heritage is also visible and alive in everything from rap music and modern to contemporary art and cutting each design. The modern Sami can be both an awarding winning filmmaker and a ranger hater on a snowboard. But they might both feel the same deep relationship with nature. If you visit northern Norway, you can also experience the Sami way of life. From Finnmark in the north In the northern Norway, you can spend a day with a ranger hater family and get a close encounter with their flock. In April and May, you can experience the annual region migration. Throughout the year, several Sami festivals offer concerts, exhibitions, and fun activities such as region races and lasso train. The Sami National Museum in Karashok, Verega, Sami Museum and the Norwegian Museum of Cultural History in Oslo are just a few examples of museums that offer captivating exhibitions about the Sami culture and, hi and history. Attending a Sami festival is a good place to start if you want to learn more about the culture and traditions. Each July, the International Indigenous Festival, Redo Redo Festivals in 
Madeleine in Trump's attract artists and festival fans from all over the world with concerts under the midnight sun and wide range of activities. Redo Redo is definitely a festival out of the ordinary. The Sami Week in Trumpso celebrate everything Sami in conjunction with their National Day on 6 February. Try your hand to at Radiant Races. Learn all enjoy concert talks and generous portions of the traditional teach and don't miss the national championship in lasso throwing attractive families and people of all ages the sami easter festival has become a focal point of their culture the program is filled with concert and exhibitions as well as fun activities like scooter cross and radio racing In 1989, the Sami parliament was opened after numerous protests in the 1970s and 1980s against the construction of a hydro electric power plant in the Aleva River in northern Norway, known as the Outer Controversy. Since then, the Norwegian Sami have been able to elect representatives to a parliament that solely focused on Sami issues. The eye-catching piece of architecture located in Karakshot in Finnmark, known as the Sami capital, is shaped as Lavo, a Sami ten, which has always been a symbol of the nomadic culture. Visitors are welcome to participate in guided tours of the parliament building Monday to Friday, given in Sami, Norwegian and English. The Sami people in Norway speak no fewer than five different languages. Of the nine different Sami languages in the world, five are in use in Norway. The three most common are Nordin Sami, Lule Sami and Nordin Sami. Pete Sami and East Sami are currently growing through a revitalization phrase in Norway. None of the languages resemble each other nor are they related to the Norwegian language or any other Scandinavian language for that matter. During large part of the 1990s, the Sami in Norway were forbidden to speak their own language and had to learn Norwegian under strict assimilation policies. As a result, slightly less than half of the Sami in Norway speak a Sami language today. For this, the Sami people got an official apology from the Norwegian government in 1999. To learn more about what is going on in the Sami accents today, the Sami Center for Contemporary Arts in Karashor is definitely worth a visit. The museum aims to be venue for exhibitions of Sami contemporary art, which ranges from new expressions to traditional to traditionals.
The whole this area was where the former outer city was built. The former outer city, there is a shopping mall before it was moved to where it's located today. But it was a good thing because they had to also develop this place because after the post box was just built directly opposite there, you can see the big building. So that was where it was before. Yes, guys, so this is the new constructed student uh, uh, hostess. It was built, so we are driving now to the uh, outer university. So before, you can see the year, this is a uh, CQM, and this construction here is the new speci uh, special hospital that is still under construction. So now we are going directly to the outer university. yes guys so welcome to outer university norway that is a university um university of outer you can see how beautiful it looks like uh with beautiful trees beautiful environment you can see it's not small it's a little bit big you know it's big university of outer wow This is good guys because we were just driving so we couldn't get into it but at least we showed you the environment of the university. Yes, lady, these are still the beautiful hostess, student hostess and outer. You can look at it. You can see how beautiful big it is. So no problem, no worries with student accommodation and outer. You see the construction. You see the buildings. Perfect. I love it. You can look at a student who said city. So that was the student um, area. Now going back to town. Finally guys, we can't leave Alta without seeing the Alta beach. You look at how beautiful it looks like during summer like this period. You see people will come to people come here for camping, for swimming, to relax, whatever. It's a beautiful beach with beautiful water. So, it's good. Thanks for watching and see you in my next video. If you haven't subscribed, Please do subscribe and join the family so we keep having fun. We keep exploring and learning one thing to another. Thanks for watching. See you in my next video. Bye-bye.